Oh my god, we are losing a lot of uh, health. Bro, I got. Do I have to do this? I can only find. Dude, help. Help. He hello? Amazing. Now bring this gift to Juliette. Alrighty. I got you. Wait. Fake Emerald Altar. <laughs> Okay, bro. Yo, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to another video here on Hypixel Skyblock. I don't know if this is gonna be the first part or not, but uh, yeah, today there's gonna be like a new update, I guess, like the 0.7.4. We come on over here at spawn, go to northwest. We can talk to this guy right here, Taylor. Hello. You look dashing today, and uh, if you go downstairs, you can talk to this guy, Seymour. Looking to buy something fancy? <laughs> Dude, if you look at this, dude, oh my god, cheap tuxedo, complete suit, uh, it's like, you, you see, my purse, I'm at 3 mil, but it's like, dude, look at this, though, because I, I just checked the, the superior, like, armor set, and it only has 40 crit damage, but then there's unstable, which is 15 per, like, armor piece, which that is, like, what, that's, like, 60% crit damage, if you take a look here, fancy tuxedo, dude, crit damage, 150%, 300 intelligence, and then dashing, obviously, max health, 150, D1. 100% damage so i'm guessing like your regular damage sword and then yeah this one is a uh, full set i think can only because it says complete suit i was debating on whether or not to actually purchase this because uh, i did check the ah to take a look because uh somebody i guess got scammed or something because they have like 50 percent so right here cheap tuxedo jacket yeah look at this so what uh, like hello strong cheap strong godly cheap i don't know dude because i don't really have any way on making money the only i only have like one way of making money and that, that takes like a, a while but uh i had seven mil so yeah we're, you know what dude we're doing it i want to do it just for the video you know this new update cheap tuxedo complete suit i think we're just gonna get the chest plate but whatever okay purchase a very expensive suit think twice about it make sure you understand what you're buying i mean shoot dude i kind of want to wait what if they like upgrade this wait is this a scam yo this might be a scam you know what dude yolo oh oh would you look at that so you get boots and the leggings and then also the chest plate okay so that's i see what you did there okay so there's no <laughs> <laughs> all right then okay yeah we got we got scuffed but uh whatever dude i thought we were just gonna get a chest plate but this say complete suit so i was like hmm, maybe it is like the full suit but there's no helmet yeah so if you guys you can get 200 crit damage man but uh you have to wear the full on set and you don't get no defense and you don't get no health so yeah i guess uh we're i guess we're gonna fully enchant this uh tuxedo in this in today's video maybe <laughs> Shoo, I don't know, maybe. Let's see. So if we do this. Wow, look at our health. What? Um, oh, this was a complete <laughs> What dude? You already have 75 health? Hello? It doesn't even matter if you wear a helmet. Wait, why do I still have so much mana? Oh, it's because I do get like hundred mana with this set. Hello? <laughs> what dude hold on what's our crit damage yet 328 and then if we hold our sword 440 um i mean shoot dude wait does our defense go down as well no okay we can get some protection books on this okay all right this is a scam but i mean you don't have to wear the full set <laughs> you can still wear this like you know just the leggings wait which one is better just spent three mil on this suit <laughs> Oh boy, dude. Let's see how much crit damage we do, though. Right, before we get into the big boy update, I mean, I don't know if it's released today, but oh yeah, we got some other new stuff as well. I don't know. I think in today's video, I'm just gonna be talking about this tuxedo set, I guess. So I got scammed, bro. I got scammed, but uh, let's see how much damage we do. 21,000? Uh, <laughs> I'm one shot, though. I can easily die so quickly. Should we risk it for the biscuit, dude? Go to the end? No. <laughs> Let's go to the Blazing Fortress first, alright. This thing probably one-shots me, dude. <laughs> I'm scared. Oh my god. Do we see if they one-shot us? Uh, hello? Wait, these guys aren't even attacking us. I think the mobs are broken. Yeah, they're like in the middle of an update and the uh, spooky event is about to just begin. So, I mean, I can't really tell. I mean, yeah, we definitely would die one-shot. Let's see how much damage you do against the Enderman, though. Just take off one piece and then you'll be good, right? If you want to wear only two pieces of this, then uh, it'll be definitely better if you put growth on it. These guys hurt. Yeah, okay. 22,000. All right, dude. Let's see how much, uh... Uh... <laughs> okay, hold on, bro. Gotta make sure I don't get one shot. Let's see, so 942. And then I went down to 850. Oh, yeah. I'll die in one hit. <laughs> okay, wait. I don't have crit chance on, huh? Well, actually, I do enough damage. 24,900. Okay. So, uh, that's all I want to know. <laughs> 
Okay, so that's how much damage we do. All right, we're good. So this is a cheap tuxedo. I mean, shoot, dude. Uh, all right, well, I guess I'll cut back when I fully enchant this after the event. So it's about to begin in the... <laughs> wow, in a few seconds. All right, but yeah, I'll be back be and then we'll fully enchant this and then we'll see if uh, the update has released after the event. But uh, yeah, I'll be right back. All right, dude. So the update finally released. I was gonna be enchanting that uh, I actually do not know where I put it. Ah, here it is. All right. <laughs> I was about to say, dude. I wasted 3 million, but nah. Alright, so here's a cheap thing. Yeah, we'll see. It was a complete waste. Don't want to spend your money on that. I mean, if you want to. You know, you can use a chest plate only. It'll be good, but uh, other than that... Yeah, don't, don't do anything, but uh, yeah, anyways, the new update came out. It's not on here, but a 0.7.4. There's a new island now, the Forging Island. They changed it, and uh, we got a new quest as well. We're gonna have new quests. Yeah, the only thing they changed, if we go down here to the Carpenter, we can actually buy some of this stuff, and they added in all these other things. I got the enchanting table. I bought it, but uh, <laughs> I forgot I'm not at the right skill level for it, so yeah, I need to get to level 22, and I'm not even that close. Yeah, there's a fireplace, chest storage, just thing. Oh my god, dude, it's pretty good, because there's like three pages but uh, i don't know if they fixed it at all but uh oh looks like there was a horseman little boss all right i guess so let's go on over here so, uh, this is a new island yeah look at this dude what's it called the park so yeah let's uh go ahead and explore it man all right so there's like eight new npcs here i mean charlie there's no uh, nothing new right here there's only one thing that uh i want to do and that is to do the race wherever the race is gonna be but it looks like this is the birch island all right and there's a lot more wood finally remember the old island dude and then we got oh this one's new so vanessa uh the rainmaker it's rain season for the right price one minute of rain i don't know if we want to get that spent a combined 7.7 .7 million coins on rain hello i wish i had that <laughs> i wish i can refund my three million that i wasted but uh, hey man whatever so yeah it looks like uh, we got more wood here find the next portal what is this we got a like, little pot here and uh oh it makes noise when you pop it all right wait i'm actually breaking it. what happens if uh, it goes like high pitch should i butterfly click i don't know i'll get banned if i do actually i don't think it matters Okay, well, now it stopped. Okay, well, whatever, dude. Uh, all right, so here it is. Uh, talk to Gustav. Oh, well, that's a new feature. All right, go up there, too. So this is, like, the Spruce Island. Let's see if there's an NPC around here. Got a bridge here. Okay, not bad, not bad. And, ooh, we got a house over here, southwest, once you come up. So let's see. Melancholic Viking. I don't know. I last saw the sea 10 years ago. Whatever. I wish I could remember what it felt like. Sadly, my memory is now my worst enemy. Please help me remember the sea. Uh, how am I going to help you? Uh, please help me remember the sea. I mean, I don't know how I'm going to help you if you have a fireplace and uh oh yeah there's like no sea there's only void out here so yeah and there's also gonna be five new fairy souls and uh i wonder if it's gonna be up here i don't think so oh <laughs> yep all right we found one of them bro that was expected like come on it was expected oh here's gustav all right and they also updated it when you start the race even at the end race there's gonna be like a little path on where you're supposed to go let's see how we do hold on let's get 5 30 mana all right what's up gustav you're the one that i need to talk to there's nothing like island racing i've traveled many islands this is my favorite to race want to try to complete the race you'll need to reach the opposite side of the island come all the way back start the race by walking over if you finish in under two minutes i'll reward you complete the woods race in two minutes uh one two three four five six seven eight nine okay race started good luck okay so we have to follow these particles i mean yeah wait am i going the right way <laughs> uh this way oh okay we gotta go oh do we have to go all the way around the island oh boy i don't even know full on island whatsoever there's like new stuff why did i start the race do we go over here we don't go over here where's the particles okay here we go all right i found a trail let's see all right let's keep on going gonna go up these steps and then what is this oh, is this right here oh checkpoint reach the other end return to the start okay i gotta return to the start then uh yeah after i learn this full-on map then uh, it's gonna be easy i just go right here right and we finish all right 21 seconds <laughs> nice talk to gustav not bad i hope you can get better than this here's a polished pebble i found it uh polished pebble Hello? Click to claim. Okay, dude, I was like, how many got a spruce sapling? What is this? Silky Lichen. All right, click to claim. You claimed it. Run the race in one minute. Gotcha. So let me right click this. Oh, this is how. Okay, so this is what people were talking about in the Leaping Sword video. You can upgrade it to a Silk Edge. And then we're going to be needing this. Well, then that's a future video then. So pretty nice. All right, let's uh, start the next one. going to learn this. I'll be back when I finish the race again. 
Oh, look at this little cheap move, dude. <laughs> All right, then. That's uh, easier. Yeah, you don't have to even go. Like, at the exact spot, you don't have to follow the particles. Just, you know, find your own way on getting here. If you have, uh... Oh, the timer's at the bottom left. I just noticed that. Finish that in 30 seconds. All right. Dang, you're getting much faster, Hunter Knight. Oh, damage. All right. Well, this is, like, for beginners, I guess. Wait, speed? Oh, you get speed, bro? Well, you know I'm using that. Run the race in 32 seconds. Okay, bro. Let's, uh, let's regenerate our mana real quick so I can get some more mana, you know? 30 seconds. Here we go. Starts now. Okay, here we go. Checkpoint, please work. And then, oh. And then hold this for more speed. More speed, more speed, more speed. And uh, we made it, dude. All right. <laughs> 24 seconds. Let's talk to him again. There's a trinket I found in the caverns behind. It finished the race in under 18 seconds. What? Wolf paw. Oh, you get a speed talisman. All right. 18 seconds, dude. Shoot. I mean, I don't know how I'm going to do this. <laughs> do I get more speed if I wear these boots? Hold on. 227 and then 260. Huh. Do indeed get more speed wearing these. Three, two, one, go. I mean, I don't think I'm going to do this properly dude yeah. I already failed let's go like this hold this go back I already fudged up dude no I did it in 23 seconds as well dude and this is uh this is difficult man this is really difficult I don't know if I'll be able to do it you know what we'll come back to this later so that's where you can get Gustav let's put these boots back on and then okay so this is the spruce this is where we were at all right I'll finish the race in 18 seconds I just you know I gotta figure out the best route in order for me to actually finish this and uh where are we what is this is this dark oak uh, yeah, this is Dark Oak. Finally, dude. They needed to do this so I can grind for it. Is there an armor piece that I'm going to be needing here? Finally. All right. There's a lot more space. And ooh, there's definitely going to be a fairy cell. Right? Yeah, yep. Yep. Told you, dude. There's definitely going to be a fairy cell in here. All right. Is there an NPC? Oh. Uh, yeah, wizardy going on right here. Dude, there's definitely gonna be a fairy soul somewhere down here as well. Let's check real quick. Let's check. Might be wrong, but, uh, ooh, there's something down here. Howling spear. Oh, wait, what? What is that? What is this? Soul of the alpha? What? No, don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. Wait, how do you... Howling spirit, soul of the alpha. We're gonna follow and uh, see. Hmm, there's no entrance at the bottom, so we have to do... We have to go somewhere. Okay, so there's three random mobs down there. But they have a lot of health. But it looks like you can't go under. You have to probably find a secret passageway. I'll look for that in a bit, but uh, for now... All right, anyways, let's talk to these. Okay, campfire at it. Hello, right click. Some call us a campfire cult. Mr. Ryan, what's up? Hello, I'm the leader of the campfire cult. To join us, you need the campfire initiate badge. So right 10 seconds in the campfire to earn one. Oh, <laughs> oh this is easy. One, two, three, four, five. Wow. Okay. Well, I'll be right back. All right. That was easy, man. Okay. Uh, what's up, Ryan? What's up? Wow. You survived the campfire. <laughs> I mean, I had a lot of health. The campfire deals true damage, which means it ignores your defense. Try to survive the trial and uh, <laughs> okay. So I use our restoration wand. We got ourselves the zombie and sword as well. Awesome. The incredible. Seems like you got the spark for this. Uh, here's your campfire initiate badge. Complete the trial three and I'll upgrade your badge. Oh. Kill four per second while burning. Oh. Oh. I thought... Well, I mean, thank you. I mean, I guess. Even though I have, like, talismans that makes me, like, immune to fire. But sure, man. I need your campfire initiate badge to upgrade it. Oh, it's been upgraded. Tier 4 of your eye will be upgraded to two trials. Tier 5. How much can I go, dude? We're taking a lot of damage now. Let's uh, use a restoration wand real quick. Let's upgrade them again. Congrats. You are ready for the next. To receive it, uh, we require 160 dark oak wood. All right. Um, all right. Campfire, 10 health per whatever when I'm burning. <laughs> yeah, you're going to be needing a lot of health for this one okay you know i should be wearing these boots so i can have more health i think this is unlimited if i'm gonna be honest with you i wonder if this is gonna go into a legendary oh my god we are losing a lot of uh health all right we're good dude i was i was getting a little bit scared that was in bruce okay well i'll update you guys later <laughs> let's go ahead and uh find other npcs and other fairy souls see if we can complete all the other fairy souls how much can we get by the way uh quest log 182 out of 185 so far we got two out of 11 so we can get 11 up here not bad i guess okay there's definitely gonna be one inside one of these acacia spruce like leaves or whatever acacia leaves there was one before so uh, maybe the highest one oh yeah there's definitely one right here easy dude easy all right we got our third one close all right so there's an npc in the back here and there's a mine can you mine this yep you can mine this all right because there's like a little mining area that uh you can go to right there not bad all right master tech 
Tactician uh, Funk? I don't know. I think that's what it's called. What the heck is it? 1.4. What? Uh, wood Singularity. Combine this seriously large pile of wood in an anvil with any wood sword to add 100 strength to it and only be applied once. Uh, 1.5 million. Now I totally wish I did not spend it on that suit. On a wooden sword. <laughs> what is this, dude? <laughs> 210 damage your collections 10 out of 10 max gains 15 damage for each combat collection of tier 7 and over of its wear hello tactician oh, we're getting this right now i need a coin this is pretty much a pigment sword then wait is it legendary no it's rare yeah well there's that i mean i can get this i mean i have the money and i can get this and oh, that's a future video we're not doing that today we're gonna be doing this in a later video dude because uh dang i'm gonna have to be making some more coins dude but yeah that's pretty much a pigment sword except the rare crit chance instead of crit damage but i mean it's still good you know and i already have this max i guess so 15 damage for each combat collection of tier 7 and over uh, oh this oh okay so if you have all this it doesn't all have to be maxed out okay see this one my slime isn't oh enchanted uh, wood okay um 320 divided by 64 that equals five stacks so we're gonna be needing five stacks of enchanted oak spruce birch dark acacia and jungle wood <sighs> oh <laughs> all right that's gonna take me a while yep i mean we could buy the sword now but yeah you know we'll do that later dude anyways so that's a good npc man 100 percent. you guys are starting off get that especially to complete your collection dude you basically have a pigment sword almost i see when you reforge it's not gonna be the same but uh we got this melody girl here want to learn the harp i mean i guess i'll teach you make a song to get started reward you get one intelligence <gasps> Bro, you get intelligence with this? Click for your first attempt. Click the harp to play your song. Do we have to do it like separately? Okay, so this is how you do it. Bro. Okay, I know for sure the other ones are gonna be so hard. I gotta focus up real quick. Right here, right now. Please don't mess up. We did it, bro. You scored 100%. <laughs> All right. Earn one to intelligence from mastering a new song. Thank you. Oh, this guy's playing that. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, dude, that's lit. Okay. Yo, that's cool. All right. So you get intelligence with these guys. All right. Well, <laughs> we're going to be doing a future video on completing all that for sure. Go check and see if these portals still work. If you want to use the portals, get to the wood area. So dark thicket jungle island. All right. So yeah, you can, and the portal is going to be right there, okay. So you can still use those portals to come over here, so. Alright, that's cool. I feel like there's going to be a talisman in one of these trees. Uh, is there anybody? Oh, Juliet. Wait, is there a Romeo? Because I saw in the things, in the forum, that there's a Romeo and Juliet here. Unless I talked to Romeo, and uh, I didn't really pay attention. Nice to meet you. What's up? Did you find my dear Romeo? He's in a cave south of here. Oh, he wears glasses and blends well in the in a crowd. Is that what those mobs down there are? He's in a cave south of here. I think this guy's going for it as well. I'm gonna go follow him. I'm probably gonna be needing potions. Maybe. All right, there he is. Okay. <laughs> it's a good thing I follow this guy. I'm guessing this is where the cave is at. <laughs> where are you? I'm trying to find gold. It's Romeo, but I can only find sand and stone here. I heard a gold mine in the savannah woodland. I like to craft a gift for my beloved Juliet. Could you find some gold for me, please? I'm trying to find gold. Here, I got I got gold for you, bro. Yeah, I saw the gold mine. Okay, it doesn't matter. Yeah, okay. Woohoohoo! <laughs> Brivals fell! Hello? I'm gonna go mine up some gold over at the gold mine. Well, not the gold mines, but over here. I was in a mini cave which is up above which is right over here let's do this real quick i mean is, is that it bro i got do i have to do this i can only find dude he 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 hello i am holding gold is it bro oh yellow rock question oh. <laughs> Bro, I'm a dumb. <laughs> okay, it wasn't okay. Well, whatever. Thank you so much. Here, could you do me a favor and bring the gift back to Julie? Why don't you do it yourself, bro? Come on. Pretty much, I'm her lover now. All right. Poorly wrapped rock. Poorly wrapped rock. Okay. Yeah, all right, Juliet. Romeo told me to bring it, not himself. So here you go. You found Romeo. That's weird. I just saw him. I just right clicked this. Uh, one million chance to deal 100% damage. Grants a one in a million. Oh, wow. Okay, well, <laughs> sorry, intentions. You want me to have this sweet? You 
Yellow Rod, what's the point of that? Here, you keep it since you're here. Can you find Romeo again? He said he was getting groceries at downtown market. So we got this thing that does one in a million percent chance of doing 100% damage. Downtown market, huh? The only thing I can think of is over at the village. The only market I can think of is this expensive, definitely not worth purchasing suits. And uh, But is this consistent like quest that doesn't stop? That's what's going on here, dude. Oh, wait a minute. What's in here? What is in here? Um, we're all packed spirit. Oh, wait. I think this is a dungeon. Yesterday, I think they ran like a test dungeon. I wasn't on. I don't know if it was for the public. But I think this is a dungeon. So this is how you can get into this dungeon, I believe. Probably, probably. I wonder. Can we just... Can we... <laughs> Oh, I just phased all. <laughs> okay. All right. I found Romeo. I'm blind. He's over here at the cell. Groceries. Haha. <laughs> He's probably here for flowers. I'm here to get flour. Okay. Could you help me get some flowers? Okay. I mean, I can get a whole bunch of flowers, dude. <laughs> I know a place. I just got to go back to my base and then, you know. Um, Haha. <laughs> here we go. All right. Uh, we got some flowers. Um, I don't know what kind of flowers he wants. You know, poppy, you know, you can't go wrong with any poppies, dude. Pretty nice, you know. I was thinking a bouquet of roses. Roses. There we go. <laughs> yes, let's go, dude. Yay. All right. Please bring the bouquet to Julia. All right. Yeah, we did it. Whoa. Good thing we got the right thing, dude. Wait, did I waste a stack of poppies, bro? Make sure you guys are holding one because I think I wasted a full on stack. All right, Julia. This is what you wanted to. You need a shiny yellow rock. What? I already do this. Just came over with the groceries. These flowers are for me. That's so kind of you. Oh, you know I'm with Romeo, right? Dear, sorry for the inconvenience. Okay. Can you please find Romeo again? He's at some sort of emerald altar. Your shiny was upgraded to yellow rock of love. I mean, guess the, you upgrade your thing. I think I know what she's talking about. I think I know what she's talking about. Let's go to the deep caverns. There's like two spots. Spots over here. This is gonna be great. Romeo, Romeo, where art thou? He does not have a name, I just realized. So we just gotta look for the skin. Uh, this is... wait. What's in here? This is an altar, right? Should he be in here? It's in the graveyard. The Oh, Emerald. Oh, Emerald Altar. It's in the grave. Okay. I know what he's talking about. Okay, okay, okay. So that's where the zombie spawns. Oh, okay. All right. I love emeralds. Okay. There's emeralds on everything I like. Uh-huh. This one can't be this, this blonde. Should you bring me some emeralds? Going to need a full stack of those. Okay. Here you go. Amazing. Now bring this gift to Juliette. All righty. I got you. Wait. Fake Emerald Altar. <laughs> Okay, bro. Uh, all right. Yeah, okay. Whatever, bro. And it's Romeo guy, dude. <laughs> I mean, shoot. It's making me give her all the stuff. Who knows, man? I might be taking her. Just saying, Romeo, you need to do your own stuff, all right? And she's definitely gonna love this. What's her thing called? Rock of love. Oof. Why did you bring this all the way here? How's this a gift? Just keep it. I don't want this. What I want is Romeo. For some reason, he's now looking for the largest, most evil patch of fungus ever a mediocre ring of love Ooh, ring wait is this a freaking uh it's a talisman oh my god dude i thought you were supposed to use it punch it but no wow where would i find the fungus mushroom island that's the only place i can think of there's a whole bunch of people going up here i wonder if uh, romeo's up here i don't think romeo's here I mean fungus oh, i guess another quartz could be like fungus um, all right we're going to the nether then these guys are also looking for romeo ah here he is all right he's at the bottom here if you go to the west up the staircase or whatever talk to him bro hey you again i wanted mushrooms to cook concoct a stew but these big red ones won't cut it i need some decent mushrooms oh wait we need enchanted mushroom blocks dude do we need enchanted mushroom blocks i swear i mean i don't i definitely do not have enough mushrooms this is why so many people are over there at the island right now is that so i'm gonna be ending the episode because uh, i'm gonna have to be grinding all this off camera and then i'll show you guys like what i get and stuff but, uh, for now <laughs> I really hope we don't need to do that, dude, because I have to be placing down some of these minions, and then, yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna suck, dude, that is 100% gonna suck. This, I can't cook a gourmet with tiny mushrooms, I need big ones. How do you make blocks? Like this? Just what I need. Except, could you enchant it? I need the perfect steel for me. <laughs> Ah, this is awful, dude. I don't think I have the recipe for it, bro. Uh, wow. Well, this is gonna be something. Hey, should we check the age real quick? You know? Wow. Well, this is something. Up to like a million five hundred thousand, dude. Yeah, no. <laughs> I think that's it, dude. I mean, can we actually forge this? Let's check if we can. So, yep, you can. Okay. Well, yeah, I think I'm gonna be ending the episode. So we got ourselves. Hold on. Let me organize.
organize my stuff real quick and then i'll let you guys know what we got so what we pretty much got is ourselves a campfire and badge got ourselves a silky lichen whatever and we got ourselves a wolf paw and then we got the hunter knife and uh yeah these guys are saying that, that you can fight the wolf boss around here and right, these guys somehow find the way to get inside i want to know how Howling cave, fight for your life against wolves from the past. So there is a cave. Oh, all right, dude, I just figured it out. <laughs> I just figured it out. Okay, we need to get that exploding. What am I calling it? The exploding uh, TNT that you get from this guy over at the deep caverns. And I'm going to need to get some coins because you need like 5,000 in order to get this uh, exploding TNT. So that's how you get inside. All right. I just went on the forums, you know, <laughs> I wanted to figure it out. So let's see. So we need 5,000. Uh, you know what? We're going to buy like two of these just in case. But uh, this is how you do it. So you go to the back here at the creeper cave, whatever gunpowder mines, deep cavern. You go all the way to the back of north. Talk to this guy, Mr. Walter, and then you get yourself super super boom tnt so yeah and then we do that and then we go back to the little island over here because this explodes weak walls so i'm guessing this is a weak wall over here down here at this waterfall so we go down here we do this and then bada bang bada boom we should be in all right that's how, how you do it okay so this is the howling cave all right this is another quest i guess i mean shoot dude these guys six thousand health i mean i need to have like pots procked in order for me to actually like kill these guys but uh yeah they say that this would be like the best spot to grind your little thing so yeah but i think there's an npc somewhere around here let's see if we can find this guy huh? here he is all right so old shaman naiku all right got true protection grants five true defense use this on an oh my gosh dude 900 that's like a million true essence right click for more trading options this is a brewing ingredient okay so these are ingredients true essence you guessing it's like true defense and stuff like that so and it's pretty much like an extra defense for your armor, I guess. Yeah, Alright, dude. That's how you get inside this little howling cave. Alright, there's one thing I need to check and see real quick. Okay, so it does reset the wall. So you do have to keep on consistently using the super boom TNT. One downside of it, I guess. But, uh, hey man, whatever, you know? So that's pretty much it. So wait. There's mossy, remember. Uh, when there's mossy, dude, there's gonna be a fairy soul around here. Get off of me, please. There's gotta be a fairy. I think it's gonna be right here. Is where the fairy soul is gonna be. Yep. Whenever there's mossy stone, dude, there's always a fairy. So let's see if we go all the way up. Uh, there's nothing okay we got ourselves another fairy soul right there that's good to know okay, i'm gonna try to find all the 11 i guess that there's 11 fairy souls in here so yeah, i'm gonna try to find that after i do that maybe i'll update you guys on where to find them but uh yeah, there's a lot of stuff to be doing now so i have to be replacing these gold minions i mean i don't really need these guys anymore i'm gonna be replacing them with mushroom minions and then yeah a meteorca ring which maybe it'll go into a rare or maybe legendary rarity maybe even this campfire bag and uh yeah we'll see man expect some stuff to be coming out this video is probably gonna be really really long but uh yeah i mean it was an update so yeah anyways thank you guys so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next one peace out